Hey everybody, it's Miss Bell here again from the Science Lab, and today we're going to be talking about heating and cooling. Very cool! Um, we're going to be using chocolate and a hot plate, which is what we call it here in the Science Lab, but it's very similar to a stove if you go into a kitchen and you see pots and pans sitting on it. So that's going to be our heat source, and we're going to take solid chocolate add heat to it so we're going to melt it into liquid chocolate and then we're going to use ice as a cooling agent to bring down that temperature reduce that heat and bring it back to a solid again so here we go so for this little demonstration experiment we're going to need some items here i have a metal bowl needs to be metal and a rubber spatula I also have some chocolate chips and that's where I'm going to pour my chocolate in. Now my bowl I'm going to place on top of a pan that I have water in. Now my um, pot is on top of my burner right here or my hot plate and it's turned on very very high so after a while my water will start boiling and get very very hot and I'm going to place this bowl on top. I'm going to add my chocolate chips inside and I'm going to use my rubber spatula to stir my chocolate and the chocolate is going to end up melting inside my metal bowl. We call that a double boiler um, if you're ever interested in knowing cooking terms. <coughs> Back here, I have two sets of trays. One is just a metal uh, rectangular kind of a baking sheet. And then I also have a square shaped tin foil or aluminum pan. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to take a bunch, a bunch of ice and we're going to place them, place the ice all along one of the pans. So here I have ice on this pan and here I have ice over here. And my second pan that I have put a um, piece of wax paper tape down, we are going to be placing those right on top. So that's going to make this top pan super super cold and that is going to help cool down our chocolate um, after it has melted. So that was our fun demo with melting and cooling off chocolate. So we started with chocolate in this little, little chocolate chip solid form and then we put it on the heat, we added heat and it melted into liquid chocolate and then we put it on top of ice and let that cool off really, really quick and it turned back down to a solid like this. Melting and cooling 
science working hand in hand. It's so fun and sometimes it's really tasty too. <laughs> Bye guys.